Hey Tech Warriors, it's McMoment here. And today we're tackling the rage-inducing problem from accusers, your SD card refusing to show up. When you want to import photos and videos or other file to Mac, this will greatly affect your mood. No sugarcoating, let's brutally murder this issue. If you find this guy useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Method 1. Check your finder settings. First, force your Mac to show the SD card. Go to Finder, Settings, and let's start off in general. Make sure that you enable hard disks, external disks, CDs, DVDs, and iPods. Then go ahead to the sidebar and make sure external disks is also checked. Boom! You may now see your SD card appear in Finder. Method 2, use Disk Utility to repair the SD card. If this doesn't work, it's time to turn to your MacBook's built-in Disk Utility. Type the command and the spacebar, enter Disk Utility. Find and choose your SD card on the sidebar and run first aid. This fixes corrupted files like duct taping a broken leg. If it fails, your card's probably dead inside but keep watching. Method 3, Nuke Lockdown Mode, upgraded to Sequoia, Lockdown Mode might have castrated your SD slot. You just go to System Settings, Privacy and Security. Scroll down and you can see the Lockdown Mode. This mode significantly restricts features, limiting potential attack surfaces. If you turn it on, turn it off. Reboot and reconnect Boom, your Mac's no longer gatekeeping. Method 4. Format the card to correct format. Of course, there is one thing we need to consider. That is, the default format of many external devices is NTFS, which Apple systems cannot recognize. In this case, we can go to Disk Utility and erase the memory card to XFAT format. This will destroy your data. But hey, if the memory card is already broken, what do you have to lose? Method 5. Recover your lost data by 4DDIG McData Recovery. Accidentally nuked your data? Use 4DDIG Data Recovery. Three clicks and your files rise from the grave. Is it really so magical? Don't doubt it, just keep watching. This professional software can scan your SD card and recover lost. Files, even if the MacBook can't read the card. Make sure your SD card is connected to your Mac. Choose the SD card and hit Scan. By default, we choose to scan all file types. Then, it's time to wait patiently. Oh my god, my document was actually scanned. Are you still worried about losing your files? Click the link below to try to recover them. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe us. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks on data recovery and MacBook troubleshooting. See you guys in the next video.